Merry Christmas guys, Zach Mars here and welcome back to the Exit the Game I've Encounter Unboxing thing. So, uh, in the previous episode of this I actually goofed up the puzzle. So, if you guys didn't watch the previous episode of this, I sat down to record the thing, accidentally re realized too late that I had accidentally drawn the door number on the wrong door, and was very confused when the point when I couldn't find the solution. And then it turned out I had the wrong door because I goofed the, one of the symbols in my brain. So yeah, we'll be that door we'll be we'll be doing later. I already have forgotten what was in that door, but in any case, I repressed it from my memory so that I can do it fresh when it actually happens. But uh, in any case, we are going to continue onward with this. So yeah, we are going to move on to day eleven. I believe this is my next one. Yes. All right. It, it looks like you have returned to the modern age. You, you walk through the you walk through the next door into what looks like an old garage. The small room is crammed with all kinds of technology. Computers and monitors are everywhere. It seems like a computer tech has let off some steam here. They seem to be working on a new computer system. You take a brief look at it, but only understand the basics. You bite into the apple that you were that you took when you were at, with you when you were at Grimm's. A moment later, you spit it out again. Oh, there's a worm in there. You're about to throw away the rest of the apple when you notice multicolored paper in the rubbish bin. You're drawn into it as if by magic, and you straighten up and look at it more carefully. That de that definitely doesn't belong in the bin. If you're not mistaken, it looks like an idea for a computer game. Please turn the page, then open door 11. Uh, ooh. Oh. It's is, is Pac-Man. It's Pac-Man. <laughs> okay, so that's what we're doing. It's Pac-Man. Okay, first things first, take the Pac-Man page. Uh. All right. All right. Take the Pac-Man page out so I actually have it. But yeah, this is the they just stuck Pac-Man in a waste bin. And I'm assuming this is the story that we need to do. So, door 11. Door 11 is over here. I should have the right one this time. Yes. I2, I1, I2. Oh, I see. Oh, I see very much. Hmm. There's things on the wall that I don't fully understand. Okay, I guess I'm assuming that'll be part of the puzzle because they, they've been important before. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, here's I won. All right, the year is seventy. The year is seventy-six. It seems this room is full of old machines. Here, Techie Steve is drawn on paper, a game he might develop later. The game just wouldn't work it at all, so he screwed it up into a ball. But if you look, you'll surely find this product of his genius mind. He finds a code. Just look with care to find the answer hidden there. Okay. And the code. Uh, okay, so the code seems to be, is related to this. Essentially, I have to look at it from the right angle, I believe, and that'll give me the code. And I have no idea what it wants me to do, or how this is going to work. Uh oh Never mind, I understand immediately how this works. Okay. Four... Two. Am I? Say four two five. So that's the number I'm getting. Okay, let's try four two five. Four two five. 
Yeah, because based on the code that I've gotten, it does seem to be 425. It wants me to go with, yeah, it wants me to go with purple, blue, then orange, and I got 425. That gives me moon, hexagon moon. Is that indeed the correct answer? We're, at, we're on day 11. Yes! It is indeed the right door. Okay, I got that immediately. I'm happy. Okay, moon, hexagon moon. That, that makes up for the fact that I screwed it up last time. Uh, moon, hexagon moon. Which door has who moon, he hexagon moon on it? All right, well, in any case, that's going to do it for today's puzzle. Um, I believe I am closing in on the puzzle that I actually need to solve, though, for the door I messed up. So, I w we will resolve that shortly. But, uh, for the time being, I'm going to leave this episode here. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to follow me on Twitter in the description below. Be sure to check out my Patreon if you want to help support me. I would appreciate that. Go check out my Discord. I want to hang out more over there. Please go check that out because I also want to do, uh, what is it, movie watch-alongs over there. I want to do something with A Christmas Carol for Christmas. And then after that, I have no idea what I want to do after that. But, uh, yeah. And, uh, yeah, if you guys want to check all that out, by all means. And then, finally, if you want to see more videos from me, then be sure to check out the videos linked on the end screen as well. The top video is the most recent video. It may or may not be this video. Where the bomb video is, the video recommended to you based on what you've already seen from me, I believe it will send you to my playthrough of the room. So please go check that out as well. But uh, in any case, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace! Mm -hmm.